This is an older laptop. Um, it's a compact 27, uh, compact Presario 2700T. And I need um, some help. Um, there's nothing wrong with it. It works. This is a beautiful laptop. It is old. Um, I think it, it's got Windows XP on it. Um, I think it goes back to like 2002. So that would be very old. It comes on fine. I don't have any problems with it. It's got a working DVD drive and a working CD drive. Um, I bought a case for it. I bought um, some kind of software that I wanted. So I can still get um, older software for it if I want to. Um, it was doing a couple of things. It, really what I need is an idea of the value um, because someone donated this to me basically for quilts for veterans. And as you can see, I've got CDs, so a lot of the quilts for veterans um, financial records are going to go on here. And so I'm thinking um, when they were new, they were expensive very well made laptop very heavy it's also modular so if I flipped it over I could show you different sections where you can if you don't use a DVD drive you can remove that and um, put more memory in um, or you can just upgrade the memory um, in the with memory sticks so I mean really well made but I need to have an idea um, just for the records, you know, about how much she donated to me. Like, is it $50? Is it um, $100? It, like I said, it's working. The only thing it started to do, and it's got a touchpad, um, it also has a mouse. Um, the only thing it started to do was when I was typing, it would start to blip. And this, the whole screen would go dark for like a second, then it would come back, and then the whole screen would go dark again. So if anybody knows what that issue is, and whether or not that might be the sign of something going on it, I'd appreciate it. But if you could just give me a low figure dollar amount, um, so I could even give them a receipt. These were machines that they used to give out to seniors in Yarmouth. Um, people that were stuck at home with nothing to do, they would put solitaire on them. Um, there was, I mean, it's so slow, it's not even funny. It will still connect, but XP is no longer supported, Windows XP, so the browsers are no longer supported, and I can connect with it through an Ethernet cable, but, um, I think it's 256, um, it must be gigabytes of RAM um, and it's so slow it doesn't connect to anything so it's basically a word processor for me for the records for quilts for veterans and um, in fairly good shape it, it was used um, quite a bit and I guess what happened to the rest of them they had several that they used to give out uh, to seniors and the rest of them because they aged went to the dump, which is really a shame. Um, now, I this is kind of like an old typewriter or an old sewing machine. I think it can be maintained. Um, and in the future, I'll probably look more into that. You know, how do I fix things? But if anybody knows what the blipping of the screen might be, or a dollar amount um, as a donation, I'm thinking $50. But if it's worthless you can tell me it's worthless too i think it's from uh 2002 like i said i don't know if you can read that presario 2700 t